Hi folks, Canadian Prepper here. So today we're coming at you in a very low quality video. We got the background sound of the engine. We got really crappy audio and it's perfectly imperfect because the, nat the nature of today's discussion is that you need to keep moving forward when things suck. You just have to keep moving forward. You have to do something. You have to occupy yourself and rest assured to know that great things are going to come. Great things only come after you trudge through absolute shit. And this is not coming from a place of, oh, I'm doing great and I've had a great day to provide you some context. No, it's been a very, it's been a terrible week, you know. But one thing I know is that as long as you don't capitulate to the pressures and backpedal on your values or retreat or cower into a little ball in the corner, as long as you stick to your guns and you keep moving forward, even if it's only a millimeter an hour, you know, in a forward direction, as long as you are not moving backwards, great things are going to come. And I'm not going to give you any like metaphors. Maybe I will like, you know, the night is darkest before the dawn, blah, blah, blah. All I can say is that the past never dictates the future. We get trapped in these self-fulfilling prophecies. And basically what that is, is that, you, you know, you tell yourself you're something. So you become that thing. And we get, we get trapped in this way of thinking where we think that our past dictates our future. Oh, I've never been great at this. Therefore, I'm never going to be good at, at this ever. Or something to that effect. Now, obviously, there, there's some truth to that. Everybody has natural abilities. You know, I'm never going to be an NBA player. It's just realistic. You know, not tall enough and my free throws really suck. But, you know, for a lot of things things which are very ambiguous, a lot of people get trapped in thinking that the past dictates the future. Just because you never were the manager of a company and you really aspire to be that, I'm not saying I do by the way, uh, doesn't mean you can't be that in the future. It's only through the shit, through the, the worst of days, the worst of times, that the best of times follow. And it's just don't lose hope, man. Do not lose hope. If it's a survival situation, if it's life, if it's depression, just get your ass up, keep moving, and something is going to come. Something good is going to come for you. Something great is going to come for you. Do not lose heart. The past doesn't dictate the future. You need to say this over and over to yourself. That's what depression is. It's living in the past. Anxiety is living in the future. Depression is living in the past. And you're going to not have a lot of energy. You're going to feel zapped. You're going to feel defeated. You're going to feel like the world is ganging up on you. But it's only through those times that character is, is created. If you really truly look back on your life, you will find that all of the amazing things that happened to you only happened after some chain of, you know, really crappy events. <laughs> you know, nothing good, just nothing great, I should say, came out of circumstances which were mediocre or good. In order for a plant to grow, it needs fertilizer. It needs shit to grow. You know, you would never think that a seed could become a massive, gigantic tree. You know, with what it has to work with. Dirt. You know, all this refuse that's been left behind by decaying organic matter. And how is it ever going to turn into something so powerful and beautiful? So if you're going through a rough time, man, all I can say is that no matter how hard it is, and this is very cliche, but no matter how hard it is, as long as you are still alive, it's not going to be that way forever. Especially 
if you keep moving forward. I'm not saying beat a dead horse and keep doing something that's not giving you any returns. No, maybe that means you need to change it up. And, you know, maybe in changing it up, that's where the magic is going to happen. Just do something, damn it. You know, when I when I wake up and I just don't feel motivated to do anything, uh, especially if I have a lot of big things that I need to do, you know, things which require a lot of mental energy and analytical thought process, you know, things where you really have to, to think and, you know, like doing my taxes or something. Even if I can't do my taxes, I'm going to do the freaking dishes. I'm going to do something. Because as long as you're moving forward, even though you may be procrastinating the big things, keep doing the small things. Just do something. Just don't move backwards. Don't be avoidant. Don't uh, just go to sleep. Don't procrastinate. Don't do nothing and just, you know, wither into a little ball and atrophy mentally and physically and emotionally, spiritually. Just get moving and things are going to happen for you. That's all I got to say today. Hope this was, you know, helpful to you if you're going through a rough time. And if you're going through a good time, just remember the good times don't last. I'm not trying to burst your bubble, but that's why I'm always, I'm more anxious when things are going good because I know <laughs> that it's not going to last forever. And uh, I know that's not always a healthy mindset to be in, but at least when the shit comes, I'm not getting all down about it. And I know that, you know, valleys are just a necessary part of life and that you can't have the peaks all the time because, you know, the peaks are nothing without the valleys. Anyways, enough metaphors. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you enjoy the video. I got a couple of uh, gear review videos uh, coming up in the next week. Uh, it's going to be a little bit of a lighter topic than, you know, this in my previous videos. But we're going to get back to the, you know, the hardcore stuff next week. So thanks for watching Canadian Prepper Oak. The best way to support this YouTube channel is to support yourself by gearing up through CanadianPreparedness.com or BugOutRoll.ca. Premium quality gear at the best possible price using the incredibly secure and easy to use Shopify platform. We offer free shipping to the United States for orders over $200 USD and free shipping to Canada over $75. So support the channel by supporting yourself.